course, the state fair is going on this weekend, but it's all about the birds as well this weekend in Sacramento. Yeah. It really is. We have some special mm -hmm. visitors that have flocked into the KCRE 3 studio to give us a preview of a big event that's happening. It's the Pacific Flyaway Wildlife Art Festival, which starts today. And Brad Snodgrass is here with us, and as well as Kelly Molden. And tell us a little bit more about these gorgeous creatures you have brought with you today. Well, we have a red tailed hawk and a little burrowing now and adorable. Well, <laughs> thank you. What we're doing is trying to promote the Pacific Flyway Decoy Association's 45th annual um, art show mm -hmm. and um, bring some excitement to the Definitely. So they're going to be there. People can meet yes. them up close and personal. Yes. How are they trained to stay so calm? Yeah, Murphy here is uh, <laughs> just <laughs> keeping an eye on us for sure. Yeah. <laughs> you know, uh, it's a trust. We build a trust with them. So and, will and people be able to touch them today, or do you hands off? <laughs> Actually, it's a hands off thing, but we do have a discovery table that's available to touch wings and talons and stuff that birds that didn't unfortunately didn't make it. Okay. But you can actually feel a, a wing of a red tail hawk. Oh, wow. terrific! Yes. And what is all of this? It's beautiful art here, Brad. You're yeah. in charge of carving these things. Well, this is the <laughs> these are the wooden renditions of these. You know, the, we do the best we can to try to emulate nature. And so this is just a cross section of birds that I've done that are somewhat representative of what you'll see if you come to the show. So and you'll we, actually see a live bird and then somebody will be carving that bird yeah, there? Yeah, we will have carving demonstrations and painting demonstrations. Um, and we will, this is a competition for us as well. So. Yeah, not only locally, this is, this is a much bigger competition. It is. Actually, this show represents some of the finest artists in the world at wow, this show. That's it's terrific. Um, uh, as a matter of fact, I come here. I always think I've done good work, and when I get there, I'm absolutely <laughs> humbled by what I've seen. Is this yours that we're looking at? These here? are some of my pieces. They're so realistic. How show. long? Wow. So look at that bird that we're seeing on TV right now. How long does it take you to do one of these? You know, that's one of the most it. frequently asked questions. <laughs> I have a Cajun friend whose answer is all my life. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, I think that's probably one of the best answers, but. A decorative bird like this, I may have as much as 150 to 200 hours in it. Um, That's a long time. And, uh, yeah, it shows and, the, the quality of the work well, there. Thank you. Back That's to the a, festival, what can families learn from this experience, from being at this festival, kids and adults as well? Well, we actually have some learning stations for the kids where they can do some hands-on activities of painting lapel pins and some other projects that we have. And then we also have some stations set up where they'll migrate through the festival and Fun. they can go you know, to the different stations and, and see what we do with different birds. And uh, it's a very good learning okay. experience for them. And it awesome. starts at 9 this morning? Yes, it does. Double Tree Hotel? Right. Okay, and right. tickets, I hear, $5 for adults and kids 12 and under are free. Is that Absolutely. right? Absolutely. And you won't get a sunburn there. Absolutely <laughs> not. It's a good shelter if it gets too hot outside. That's right. Okay, it goes through Sunday. You see it there. Tickets just $5. Come on out and say hi to these majestic creatures and everyone out there. It's going to be a good time for the entire family.